Okay, I think we're good to go. Yeah, we are. With mortal shell. This is gonna be an interesting one. Uh, I feel like now we're gonna be able to get into the actual game, you know. Previous episode, well, not episode, stream, was just me adjusting to this game. And now we can, like, get on with the real shit. Uh, hopefully. Hopefully, goddamn, I'm already yawning. <laughs> not even tired. Yeah, it's really weird. It's doing it again. Twitch. Where it says my session is at zero. Did this last time as well. And then it picked up at like two and a half to three minutes in. Whatever. We can have, we have two viewers already. So hey, everyone. Uh, you know, it just catches you off guard. Because I remember there was this one point where uh, Twitch was having issues. And the counter was at zero. I mean, or the timer. There as well. Okay, so we killed a boss, right? Yeah, that's what we did. I'm going to wait for like a minute longer, but we killed the boss and I think there was a, I discovered that there's a shortcut here and I ended up dying, um, which wasn't good, but it happened. We discovered this dude as well. He gave us a fetch quest. Of course it did. Um, and that's about it. Yeah, I don't think anything else happened. By the way, where is my mind? Thank you for the follow. Really appreciate it. Yeah, I think we can get going. We can get going and people can kind of join as they come. Yeah, I'm like 90% sure this is... Yep. There's my dead body. What a shitty place to put a shortcut. I mean, not shitty, but you know. I think that's a dead end as well. There's nothing there. Um. Thanks, Snapchat. So I like genuinely... Oh, fuck. Swing like an idiot. Oh damn, aggro ranges. A little bit more. Oh shit. Okay. This is not good. This is no bueno. God damn it. If I can get through this, did that work? I think that worked. Damn. I was I was trying to parry. Listen. Don't even worry about it. Damn. Not a good start. We are not off to a good start. It is full is dead at least. Are you fucking kidding me? Apparently that's like the top tier tactic I saw somewhere that you swing and you harden. I did it too early. And then you can like uh, continue the swing. What? Why didn't the parry work? Strange. Strange, strange, strange. Boiled frog. Nice. Fucking love that shit. Oh man, Chad is gonna be dead today, isn't it? I hope not. I hope it's, I'm not going to be talking to myself. If I do, whatever. 
Look at this expert level mortal shell gameplay. Yeah, you ain't saying anything like that, right? Being very careful here. One thing I've noticed uh, is that definitely this is a dodge backwards type game. To me, this game seems less about. Um, you know, dodging to the side. And more about dodging backwards. Cool. Things are actually going a lot better. Uh, not to get arrogant here or anything like that. Because I'm, I'm probably going to still die a lot. But hey, things are going fairly okay now. There was a boss here as well. Another boss. We'll see what we can do about that. Cool. Oh yeah, these guys are... Let me see what the healing items I have. Uh, Roasted rat, I know about that, but I've picked up some frog. Yeah, whatever. Hey Nocturnius, what's up man? Hello. Hello, hello. This is where the boss was. It's sort of like a boss type enemy. Let me eat a rat. Whoa, shit. My mistake. Knocked into my mind. Mic stand. Wonder if he's gonna be here. I think he's gonna be here. Let me see. Okay, I think the Harden is gonna be muy efectivo against this guy. Uh oh. The parry less effective. What the fuck? That's so that's so fucking fast. Oh, he motherfucker! Did you see him pause with the hit? I already beat one boss, though. I think that was the like a big monster with like two swords. I beat that one. That one was pretty easy. Got him on the second try. This one seems a little bit more like it's a tiny arena. Maybe I'll just skip him. I mean, there is a temptation to just go and explore. Um by me, you know. Because there's a lot of areas you can go to in this game. Uh, here at the start. If I remember thing 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 beyond on this dude. This is, fuck. Okay. Always forget about this. Yeah, this is where the boss was.
Oh no, there was a crawl space. First thoughts on the game? It's good, you know, I'm liking it. Uh, I mentioned to people in the previous stream that... Uh, oh, fuck. I'm maybe not the biggest fan of these, like, very slow Souls games. This feels a little bit Lords of the Fallen-ish, but... Oh, it leads to the same place. Now, the question is, is this the same dude? It's not the same dude. It's like a weaker version. Uh, that this feels a little bit Lords of the Fallen-ish sometimes. But I do very much like the atmosphere and kind of the design. Oh shit, Inhabit Unknown Shell. We have, an we have another one. And this dude looks straight up badass. He looks like... I said he looks like the creator from uh, Prometheus. Even though that was a shitty movie. And this is how we'll be able to like pick classes, right? I think. That's like the... My understanding. That all these shells have like different weapons and equipment. Oh fuck. A man is more than just a sleeve. Oh, he's fast. Okay. This is a little bit faster. Somewhat, okay. I'm glad I went through there. He seems, he feels faster. So what happens like... Oh, shells. Haros the vassal, unknown shell. Oh, shit. I'm gonna like this if this is like the gimmick quote-unquote of this game i'm gonna be enjoying that let's look at this one as well now that i've been rewarded i'm like curious they're like classes in general oh fuck these traps Uh, gonna interrupt his guitar, guitar playing. It's not a guitar, it's a lute, but whatever. I can play that lute as well. Fuck, this parry doesn't work. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think we're in trouble. Damn it, of course he would kill me. Fuck. <laughs> to be fair, I feel a little bit cheated by that. Just slightly. Just slightly. I think I know where this is. I think I've been here. Get out. Are you kidding me? That was straight up some wily e. coyote shit. Unbelievable. Where is he shoot? Oh, okay, he's shooting from there. This would do like no damage either. At least. Okay, 
think I'm gonna heal. So these dudes, these crossbow dudes, are really just like harassment, right? What they feel like. Okay, I definitely haven't been here before. I don't remember any area with this many crossbow dudes. My bad. Okay, I'm swinging like an idiot. You just pretend that didn't happen. Oh fuck, okay. I thought I was out of range. Gonna have to pop a rat. Cool. It's a very interesting game. I like this hardened mechanic, honestly. Feels like a parry, but it's not, you know. Yeah. I definitely have not been here. Oh, the blood tinge one, that was a fun one. I remember. I actually haven't played Bloodborne in a while. Maybe it's time for a revisit. I don't know what else I can come up with. In terms of like interesting Bloodborne runs. You know. Arcane. I've done an Arcane run like way way back. It's my, It was my second ever Bloodborne run. But I just didn't see like. I didn't see the point. It's like not a good way to put it. Uh, I never managed to like do enough damage with Arcane. Maybe I was just doing it wrong. I mean, the game was pretty new back then. So maybe people just like haven't figured out the optimal stuff. Scripture of Defiance. I genuinely don't know what the hell the difference is between this guy and the first guy. Aside from the name, because they have the same weapon. We have to change your weapon. Whatever. So maybe an arcane run, <laughs> arcade run. Not an arcade run, but an arcane run would be fun to revisit. Use the hunter tools a little bit. Get flame spray as soon as possible and go for something like Moonlight Greatsword. Yeah, I heard that's a good weapon for that, actually. Moonlight Greatsword is pretty good. Plus, I've never used it. It's kind of a Pain in the ass to get, isn't it? But maybe not. Hell, I've done pain in the ass things in Bloodborne before. Yeah, I think that might be a good one to consider for the future. I heard that this game is not very long, so... I think we'll be able to... Oh, that's stamina regeneration. Shit. I was gonna say... I was gonna say, harden, but too late. It's gonna put me like way back. Like, there's no like checkpoints in this game, right? Not in like conventional way. At least I haven't seen one. A flame spray, moonlight. Might be an interesting one. 
not having the parry. We'll see, we'll see. We'll see what happens. This is the one thing I noticed that I don't like about this game. The fucking insane load times. Uh, this is like straight up some PS1 load times. But you know. What can you do? I know this area now. Okay, so we have one in there. I need to like revisit these now that I'm like a little bit more. Oh, and then you can like switch out. Peace is a misconception. Interesting. Yeah. Oh, through the boss. Well, shit. Okay. We're going for these. So. I now know. Okay, that's at least good, you know, that I wandered around like this. That now I have. Like some idea of where everything is. I need to go and definitely pick up my body or souls or whatever. I'd like to level up the other guy. Oh fuck, of course. So you can harden out of that. This game likes its fucking traps. It's That's for sure. Sorry to interrupt Woodstock here. But... How is he not dead? So, like, fighting two enemies in this game is uh, not easy. Fuck. Thought it would recover, honestly. Alright. Get back in there. Okay, this is a little bit of an interesting situation. Because you get like one freebie, like in Sekiro. One like death where you get knocked out of your shell. And that's it. And I've used it like an idiot. But what happens? Okay, no plunging. There are plunging attacks. So I was gonna say, what happens if I just drop down here? This is like somewhere where I died. It died around here. Just skip all this bullshit. Yeah, that's me. Get my stamina back. Oh shit. At least I have HP now. Cool. So I have a look around here. Listen. Kind of a dick move killing all these street musicians, but... What choice do I have? Ornate token. It's like currency, right? Or something. Probably. I'm sure this is all gonna... Oh, fuck you.
We're back in the swamp, aren't we? I think we are back in the swamp. This seems familiar. That's one thing. This area kind of all looks the samey. A little bit samey. Obligatory dog appearance. Cool. I... This looks to me like the swamp. Yeah, and there's the frog, right? Somewhere in there. Oh, that's when you... Okay, that's when you do... Because that's like the danger meter, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The game mentioned it. I totally know where we are. Okay. Yeah, I totally know where we are. This is excellent. Okay. We're all good. The area makes sense. Uh, I've got to read on things. Fuck, this game is slow though. Oh. Okay, well, I mean, even if I die here, it's like not going to be the end of the world. But I totally know how this all works together now. This is where the the lady is. Okay, so what I need to do is... Okay, I am in the, the other shell. So what I'm going to do... That sounded a little bit wrong. Seek this name. What's your name, girl? Solomon the Scholar. Okay. Good for him. Oh, he's a cool one? Okay. Solomon becomes familiar with items more quickly. When talking to NPCs, Solomon gains a segment of resolve. Enemies, the duration of time enemies remain hardened when you're separated from Solomon is increased. Okay. All of these sound good. Hella expensive though. Someone has a chance to heal on using a weapon ability to slay an enemy. Okay. I think I'm liking these. And then, like, this is what I wanted to check out. If I remember correctly, this is where you will be able to, like, get the weapons, right? Yeah, this dude went that way. I totally understand now. It's like this, you know. Galaxy brain. So these are where you get the weapons. And those are where you get the dudes. There's a great sword. I'm assuming that's like some mace spear type thing. And this is some like scythe weapon. And then you can like upgrade them. That's why they have the same weapons, the two dudes. Oh, I, to I totally understand now. And what I can do... What I'm gonna do is I'll get one of these abilities because I'm going for that boss. And if I'm going for that boss, I'm probably gonna die. So I might as well use... Which one do I want? I think this is gonna be more useful. Um... But why can't I? Oh, you need the glimpse too. Fuck. Okay, it's not just the... I never... I didn't actually notice the first time I leveled up that you used the glimpse as well. Okay. So let's see. I seem to... Rem Did he just seriously hit me in the cutscene? Is that really what just happened? I was gonna say, I seem to remember from the previous stream 
that the age-old Souls game tactic of running past everything works in this game as well. If you don't get hit. But I think... If I want to get to a boss quickly... Yeah, this works. This works. I should have bought, bought some healing items from the dude. Not the big Lebowski, but you know. Yeah. It works though. Speed run this shit. Okay. This is the way he exits is so funny. I don't know why. Okay, I need to get a grip on this dude. Okay, so you can't counterattack that. That's the grab attack. Can I at least watch my parry thing? Oh fuck, I'm out of stamina. Man, the poison. The poison can straight up kill you too. Come on. What about... Okay, R2 might be the counter attack to that. Because yeah, he actually puts quite a bit of distance between you. Oh, fuck. Come on, bitch. Manny has a lot of HP. Damn. <laughs> so fucking. That's pretty funny. I like that attack. I'm gonna die from... Man, that drop quick is fucking quick. How am I not dead? He just drop kicked me out of my... Is he gonna drop kick me out of my body? Oh, of course, he's gonna... <clears throat> Wonderful. Man, he really like... Damn, you have to dodge a lot earlier in that. Yeah, and backwards too. Not to the side. This is another thing. This is not the only Souls game where I experienced this. Where... Or Souls-like. Where you know... Oh, fuck. I guess that doesn't deal as much damage. Where you know like you're meant to dodge more backwards and just the sole instinct is to dodge to the side. Oh, it wasn't charged. I thought we were charged. This is gonna be a little bit close. Got you now, motherfucker. This is too close. Go for it. Yes. Eat shit, bitch. Die like a bitch. It's the easiest thing I've done so far. <laughs> of course it is. 
All right, and we have a new shell. I don't like how he... Why does it have to be like so crotch focused? That shot, it's like very... It's like very in the package, you know? Oh shit, this guy looks cool. I'm liking him. So these are all like dead bodies, basically. Hell yeah. So this one has less HP. Oh, but he has like a... Look at that dodge. That is a cool dodge. Now see, the question is going to be... And I don't want this spoiled, if you know. The question is going to be... Yeah, that's stamina bar though. The question is going to be, is it better to focus on one or to upgrade all of them? Come on. I wonder if the dodge is actually... This does feel nice. And look at how quick... Did you see that recovery? Depends on the playstyle. I can imagine. I thought so as well. Um, to me, I'm liking this dude. I feel like, you know... The stamina thing... I think that fits my playstyle. Oh fuck. The HP thing on the other hand. <laughs> not so much. Okay, you know what? Screw all these guys. I can run for fucking ages. And dodge as well. I think this is the speed run guy, for sure. Like, if I had to come up with a speed run strat for this game, I'd probably say use him. Like, get to him as early as possible and use him. Is this? This is some fast shit. Okay, I'll get the name. I don't know if I can. Uh, she's very like... Okay. Okay, that's a little bit ominous. I have no idea what's going on. She's like very, you know, Robin Thick vibes is what I'm getting. Uh, for sure. Steal the acolyte. So what is I'm assuming again he's gonna be the fast one. Tia will sometimes release a poisonous... He's gonna fart there, right? Of, of course that I would make that joke. Uh, taking poison damage heals Tia for a poison portion of the damage which would have been dealt. Killing an enemy gains buffs... Po okay, he's the poison dude. Sprinting doesn't consume... This is definitely the speedrun guy. 
uh, gain damage on low on stamina. Oh shit, look at this one. Gains 20% chance to lose stamina instead of health on taking damage. Poison enemy increases the chances of... Okay. Regain last chance. Oh, he has second chance. Man, this is the dude that ate yesterday's chili. For sure. Where is the fourth guy? I'm just switching back to him because I need to look over his abilities. Okay, there is uh, Teal. There's Solomon. Okay. Because uh, I don't remember what exactly this, this dude does. Chance for enemies to drop additional glimpse. After hardening, enemies killed have a chance to drop additional... Okay, harden cooldown. That's a good one as well. High resist stamina to rapidly refill during hardening. Oh yeah, so this is definitely the... I'm getting it. Like, this is a tank dude. Uh, kind of in-between dude. And where is he? Fast dude. Where's, there's fast dude. And this is the one... This is the one that's in the castle. Right? Yeah, he is. And he might be... Ranged dude, maybe? Mage dude? I don't know. We'll, we'll see when we get to him. I should use the... Because I, I, I see now that the glimpse is tied to each of the characters. So I should like probably balance out how I'm using them. How many glimpse? I have three glimpse with him. But you can also use glimpse, right? You have... Yeah, these. Interesting. So what happens if I... Yeah, you get glimpse. Cool, cool, cool. It all makes sense. So what we're gonna do here is... I'm liking this dude's abilities. And I, now I don't have the thing for it. This I wanted to get. And it's cool that you like get to learn about them, I guess, as you unlock these. Okay. The other thing I remembered, but I kind of fucked myself because I forgot to, uh, is I wanted to go and get some healing items. Because, man, this game is fucking stingy with its healing items. I don't have shrooms now, at least. Alright, bruh. Exactly, you know how it is. Uh, again, I said this in the last time, I'm pretty sure what this guy has in the corner is a bong. Uh, so you know how it is. You know how we get down. Okay, I can... I can get one rat. Thanks, Snapchat. By the way, have any of you actually added me on Snapchat? If not, you can add me. Username is the same as everywhere else. Mr. Sketchhead. Uh, wait a second. This was where I'm supposed to go, right? I think so. And then we gotta go get the weapons.
<laughs> God damn. Always. Always. I'm never gonna remember that. I swear. What up, homeboys? Okay, I was too far. I wanted to be... Oh, shit. Pop the shroom. I'm playing like an asshole all of a sudden. Cool. I'm gonna have to pop the rat. Again, I was playing like an asshole. Lost a lot of HP. How the fuck do you run and attack? Oh, it's R2. Damn. Gotta throw that twist in here. Running attack is with R2. Okay. That's gonna make things a little bit more convenient. But I do like my running attacks. Oh, no, don't fall off. Okay. Wily Coyote works both ways. I cannot believe he can hit me from there. It's unbelievable. But maybe... Just run past him. Yeah, I think I figured this out. Run past him. Wait. I think this guy definitely has the best. He really is the balanced one. He has the best balance between stamina and HP. It's kind of how I thought it was going to be. Fuck two of them. I fought two of them before, but... I mean, a little bit clusterfuck-ish. It's all good. We got this. Just be confident. Fuck. Okay. Be not that confident. I thought I dodged that. Hmm. Okay. Well, this is an interesting one. It's a predicament for sure. Alright, I'll go back there. I think I'll stick with this dude. Maybe. Should I try to dodge, dude? I don't know. Nah. Nah, I'll stick with him for now. I was just talking about how I like his balance. This is a good game. I gotta admit. Like, now, I, I thought that this would be the session where I start to like this game. Uh, I wasn't sold in the first episode, I'll be honest with you. I was like, yeah, this is okay, but nothing... Now I'm kind of, I'm more and more sold as we go along, honestly. I mean, this game, the other thing I didn't mention, I should have mentioned at the start, is that this game is also hella cheap. Uh, so, when a game is this cheap, I'm always a little bit more likely to excuse things because you know 
Like, look at it. This this game looks very nice, and the art style and it looks grand and shit. So, the fact that the small studio like this brought it th together, uh, somebody said that f like 15 people worked on this game, which is kind of crazy. Because oh fuck, you wouldn't be able to tell. I mean, people have made shittier AAA games, for sure. Yeah, not on PC yet. Yeah. Is it out on Xbox? Well, what even is out on Xbox these days? And shit out on it. Alright. He just straight up appears out of nowhere. Did they say they were gonna port it on PC though? That's the other question. Oh, 2021? Fuck. I'm assuming it's gonna have like more content and everything as well. If it's gonna take them that long to port it. That tra that was some Dark Souls 2 shit. Do you see that tracking? Okay. So we're gonna really try not dying. He told you. I just had an idea. I want to see if I can do it. Okay, you two, just, yeah, just keep playing. wonder if this works it's a fucking duet is that I, I knew it fucking excellent yes game of the year right here oh and you can like scoot around Excellent. Game of the year. Truly. And now I'm going to kill you. Sorry, musician friend. Listen. Let me just ask you this. In what other Souls clone can you play a duet with your enemies? Or what are this, what Souls game? I told you, I said it in the first stream as well. That what if is if this is just Woodstock, you know? And everybody is just like high off shrooms, and none of this is even real. Okay, I picked it up. It could very well be. It could very well be. I mean, Woodstock actually the first one had a lot of like folk artists so you never know I cannot be I'm so happy that they thought of that as well That's the sh type of shit I like. No. 
Cool. Hence, I'm going to pop another shroom. Large bolt, unknown effigy. These effigies are showing up everywhere. I think that's just a word that Souls-like makers really like. Effigy. Yeah. I mean, I can see why. This is a good one. You know. You have... Varying levels of quality. And that's putting it very politely with Souls clones. Most of them tend to be good, you know. I don't want to roast Souls clones because... You know, they come from a place of... Appreciation, but some of them, man, are just... Whew. Some of them are like that. This one is good. This is one of the good ones. Remnant from the Ashes was also good. It actually... This game's this game feels oh you just get this one okay this game feels familiar or kind of similar to Remnant from the Ashes look at this one though maybe this is gonna be the HP one or like the tanky the super tanky one yeah this dude's straight up like yeah he is. All right. Oh shit! Really, you can you got this game for free? That's pretty good. Like I didn't pay much for it either, but free. Hello, worth it. Oh, the Epic Game Store. Yeah, yeah. I. EG like shortened like that it sounded like you know like some convention or something but those ain't happening that's why I was like huh I get it now wait where did I come from okay so I got all the dudes I'll be able to figure out which one I like he's slow this one is slow you can definitely tell I mean the HP though He also at unbelievable. <laughs> okay. But then again, at least it's consistent because when I went over the edge, it like uh, it did the same for me. Like I kind of hung on. So I can't exactly be mad about that. <sighs> But man, is this some sorry-ass stamina. Very, very possible that this is going to be the least used one for me. Because I'm not like a big tanky type dude. I'll get the name anyways, because whatever. Eredim the Venerable. Cool voice, though. So what does he have? Uh, on kill gains buff which reduces damage. Next attack will deal, deal massive damage. Execution stack. 
Okay, max HP. Yeah, this is all about being aggressive and kind of like tanky. Oh, so these are like shared. Okay. Resist being knocked down. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is I'll switch to the... Wait, not this one. No, it is this one. Teal the Acolyte. Because I think I'm... Yeah, he's Havel. Now see, when you put it like that, I almost kind of want to use him. I like this one a lot. I like Solomon. This dude... Haros, he kind of feels like nothing. He doesn't do anything special. This is obviously the fast one. I don't know. I'm so conflicted. Because my other thought is if this game is kind of slow playing like this, like we might as well go for one of the tanky dudes, right? Really? Yeah. So I think maybe this dude and this dude are going to be my two. I think I'll focus on two. It's how it feels like. Okay. Now for the weapons. I know where this one is. We'll check it. Oh, but do they like match with one of the characters? It seemed like it. Did you see that? This is for sure matched with this dude. Oh, no, no, no. They all transform like that. Whatever. Yeah, I know where this is. I know where both of these places are. Alright. And the last one. Just to take a look. Mm-hmm. I'm not sure. Oh, okay. Obviously. All right, then. Let's go. Maybe I'll drop this fucking dude. I don't know. Okay. This straight up cheating. Okay. Oh, don't even, like, l did you see how little that dealt? <laughs> okay. I think playing as this dude might have its advantages. Yeah, we'll go here first. Or down there, or whatever. I'm liking that I got hit by that big ass swing and that's all the damage I took. I kinda... I kinda appreciate that. Just gotta be careful. Not to get screwed by the lack of stamina. He looks cool. Right? He's definitely the most unique looking. I don't know why he reminds me of the... Have any of you guys ever played the Neverhood? It's like a puzzle game. Like old puzzle game. And... The main villain has... N not even villain. Oh no, it's the dude you rescue. He kind of has like a... A crown like this. Kind of like a square ass head too. I wanted to parry something.
Did you step on his guitar? I think I did. This kind of feels generous. It uses this resource though, doesn't it? Let me just check. Yeah, it does. Okay. What is it called? Resolve or something? That's probably a smart idea. Let's be careful. Alright. I think I am grasping this combat system. Quenching acid. It's a weapon in hands. Yeah, and this is where the dude went with my weapon. This is where that mace type thing is. Yeah, this is where, like, my instinct is to be aggressive after the Harden. But with this dude, you cannot be, because he doesn't have the stamina. Unless you get the kill like that. You know what? I'm gonna get drink. <laughs> he just, like, tosses it away. Pick up Effigy of Eridim. Okay. KKK. Oh wait, no, don't say that. That was unintentional. Twitch banning coming in 3, 2, 1. Rip guys, it's been fun. Gonna be doctor disrespected. You know. Oh, the double hits. We got those. Come and get your double hit. Double kills, too. Oh, no. Almost. Almost double kills. Look at this ranged bitch. Trying to use range against whatever his name is. I already forgot his name. Oh fuck. I'm trapped? Seriously? Okay, that was not good. I knew that would be, like, I had a feeling that would be an ambush, but... Still. I still got a shit ton of HP. Glimpse? I don't know if this is where we... It did, yeah, definitely. The little closed entrance. Like, we know an ambush when we see one. I like how you can just do this forever. I appreciate that. That it's not like on a timer. I, I'm never gonna get used to the running attack being mapped to R2. I 
And it would make it more of a challenge for sure. I don't know. See, I, I think we have to go that way, though, instead of up this cliff. I think the cutscene showed him going this way. I'm gonna parry the shit out of this dude. Are you kidding me? Okay. Maybe I ain't gonna parry the shit out of this dude. Okay. God damn it. I can parry the normal enemies. Damn, I'm gonna have to pop a rat again. It's whatever. Fuck. Maybe I'm not as good at parrying as I thought I would be. I need to get used to things being a little bit slower in this game. You do get HP back from it though. So there is benefits to doing it. Exactly what I needed, another rat. What? <laughs> okay. That didn't work. That didn't work as well as I, it did in my head. Cool. I feel like I'm gonna hate the ranged enemies by the end of this. I cannot believe. How did that last hit miss? And he shot me. Alright. Interesting. That's gonna put me like way, way back, actually. Okay, maybe I got a little bit over aggressive. I think so as well. Has there ever been a Souls game or Souls like where the archers weren't a pain in the ass? I don't think so. But hey. Just how the game goes, you know. Case in point, you know. I think what we're gonna do. I think going like this way is way easier than going through this stupid shortcut. I got hit every single time I went through this shortcut. Although here you take fall damage, which is... also kind of stupid. Sometimes you just gotta bring out that sharp cheddar, you know? And cheese enemies. Hey, there... They're chasing you, aren't they? In An Orlando for sure. So why not return the favor? Question is, can I just like meander past these guys? That's such a good word, meander. 
I like that word. Yes, you can. Ouch. Did they just friendly fire? I'm actually like really liking this combat system. Now that I'm getting into it, I think this is a very neat idea. Yeah, it is. It's it's very good. Oh, come on. Lure him is behind this. Is he going to be smart enough to circle around? Yes, he is. Did you see the trajectory on that? That was crazy. He's dead. It's like they don't even do any damage, it's just annoying because they interrupt you. And all these like low level bitch enemies take three hits and these dudes take five. Four. My bad. Case in point. So I get my shit back from beyond here. And I'm pretty sure that's where we actually have to move forward. One thing I do hope is that there's going to be more enemies. Because so far we've been fighting these guys. Uh, these three. Hopefully there's not going to be like a Neo situation on our hands. Okay, like aiming without locking on is just, just doesn't work in this game. Just don't work. I'm still doing it for some reason. I don't mind this dude's like inferior stamina it isn't that noticeably worse how the hell did I even die to these enemies I don't even know oh yeah because I was trying to parry like an idiot Plunge attack this fool. Come on. He's smart. But not that smart. Come on. Wait, is there like a... So I thought the idea is that one hit and you're broken out of the Harden. But there seems to be some like leeway period. <laughs> That's pretty good. When you walk over the... <laughs> of 
course. Of course. Just couldn't resist putting a trap there, right? Just couldn't resist. I'm so hoping that I'm going the right way. It feels like the right way. Wait a second. Are you fucking with me? It leads back. Bruh. That's a bruh if I've ever seen one. How did I not connect that debt? Am I just an idiot? Very possible. Or did I just puss out with going forward? She's very, like, sexual in everything. Okay. Resist being knocked down. On kill, reduce his damage. It's pretty much all we can... Uh, I think this is the one I want. I have no idea what's going on with the lore, with the lore. About done, yeah. Hey Dean, what's up? I'll go for like 10-15 more minutes and thereabouts. That's what I was thinking. But you know, I'm back on the stream grind. So... You're you you won't have to wait like two weeks for me to go live again. Rousing commerce indeed. Uh let's get two of these. Wait, not that. Fuck. I got the wrong thing. Whatever. I'm gonna drink one just as a just as a whatever. You went to Cedar Point, Sandusky, Ohio. This is a theme park, right? Cedar Point. Yeah, yeah it's a roller coaster. That one has it has one it has a record in something, right? I seem to remember. Oh shit, wait a second. That's how you and okay. I thought this was like a uh, pine resin, but it's not. It's like a tight knife shard. Many many world records. I can imagine. You know, I can't even remember when. When I've been on a roller coaster. Last. Like we don't even have a big roller coaster park. In Hungary, we had one in the city, but it closed, and they only kept like they merged the zoo was next to it, so they merged it with the zoo, and they only kept like three rides, which are like kind of like heritage, or considered heritage sites, because they're from like the 50s, uh, so they ca only kept those three. So I don't even have like a roller coaster place. Hopefully, I went to the right place. Here. This is the one, right? Oh, fuck this. This goddamn trap, I swear. Okay, you know what?
the off. <laughs> this went better in my head than in reality. I don't know if this is a good idea. I might be doing something stupid. But my idea is is that I can just come up here and then we can like kill whatever comes our way. Except for these fucking archers. Well, thank you. <laughs> Yeah, the VOD is out. It's going to be up on YouTube as well. Uh, later. In fact, probably tomorrow. No, tomorrow I got to post Rayman. I haven't posted that in ages. Cannot be yeah, you really cannot go unlocked in this game. This doesn't work. So, anyways, what I was saying is, uh, I haven't been in uh, on a roller coaster in so long. I do like them. What the fuck? The the one type of roller coaster I cannot, I just cannot do is the the straight drop, like the straight downward drop. That's just ain't for me fam it ain't for me probably could because like normally I am scared of heights and you know usually in, on those ones your legs are like dangling and that's the other thing I cannot take any roller coaster that's like the the hanging one where you're like hanging from the track yeah can't do it what the hell Haha. <laughs> this she self aware. So like when are we gonna get our weapons? I feel like I might save up for some of these. Everything is kind of hella weird. Okay. Disrespectful. See? That's what happens. What an asshole just like ripping out the... <laughs> and now he's dead. All right, well, that was Mortal Shell. That was a fun game. This is going to be like some teleporter thing. Or like some fast travel thing. If I had to guess. What? Oh! I think I figured out how you get your weapons. Oh damn, the stamina. 
You can hella parry this guy. I'm betting you. Oh shit, you cannot heal. Fuck. I'm not paying attention. Can you heal? No, you cannot. Not here. Fuck, he's fast. Got knocked on my ass. Get in, get in. I should have picked a dude with more stamina for this one. I didn't know there was going to be a fight involved, to be fair. Kind of crazy when the other dude has the harden as well. It's an interesting dynamic. Fuck, see that's the when you when you fuck up. Fucked up again. He's gonna be pissed. No, he's not. What is he doing? I thought he was going for his like big finale attack or something. Fuck. He started as a carous carousel. That's really cool. I didn't know it was that old. Bow. I'm kind of like I'm liking this combat system honestly. It's very slow, uh, but whatever. Uh oh, don't die now. If I die now, I'm gonna be so pissed. Give me that weapon. It's so weird, and you just get it's eaten or something, right? By the fish. Oh no, we get eaten. This is a. Did we get eaten pre previously as well? I don't remember. We probably did. Okay, maybe it's good that I went with the HP dude. I don't know if I could have done that with the other ones. Smoldering Mace. Yeah, somebody said, oh, Nocturnia said above that it's coming to PC next year. 
only next year, unfortunately. It's kind of a shame. Okay. A different running attack. Yeah, 2021. It's a long time, I'm not gonna lie. Look at the cinematic camera. You seeing that? That was unexpected. I am really hoping that this is a shortcut back to somewhere. It feels shortcut-ish. Hello, game. I was gonna say, if it takes that long to get to Steam, it's hopefully gonna have some... Oh, that's where we came from. It's weird because it just like plops you in there. I thought we like teleported or something. I just tried this shit out. It's an interesting weapon. It deals less damage, probably because I don't have it upgraded. Eh. This one feels kind of eh. It's a yeah, it is a big bopping stick. It doesn't have as much range though as I thought it would be. Or I thought it would have. It's interesting. The question is, can you switch weapons? Oh shit, you have like... Okay. Or do you have to go back? That's gonna suck if I have to go back. I think we do. I think we do. I think I'm gonna have to, well, not have to, but I think I'm gonna call it a day. Uh, what I'll do is I'll go back and switch out my weapon. I'll go collect the other weapons as well. I think that's what we're gonna be spending time on. I'll use it a little bit longer. I think I'll have to switch to a dude that has more stamina to use this one. I'll switch to the other dude I'm using for the other weapons, just so that I use them equally, kinda. Alright boys, thank you very much for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed the stream 2 of Mortal Shell. Next stream is going to be Wednesday in two days. So, yeah, not that long of a wait. Hopefully you guys can join. Um, maybe I'll do, I'll try 8 p.m. CET for streaming. I'm still kind of deciding between 9 p.m. and 8 p.m. So I'll see, whatever. It's going to be on Discord and YouTube anyways. So, yeah. I'll wrap it up here and peace out, guys. See you.